So I'm uploading this video, and uh, it's processing, and while one video is processing, I believe this is Saturday's video is processing, Sunday's video I'm editing, no, yesterday was Monday, today's Tuesday, so yesterday's video, um, Monday I'm editing, and Sunday's video is processing. Um, Monday's video, you know, I did a little talking about some of the hate that's on um, on YouTube on some of these big name celebs or YouTube celebs like C.T. Fletcher and Cali Muscle. Uh, I think the reason why I defend Cali Muscle so much um, is because I actually read his book and, and I, I kind of got a better insight as to who he is, what he's been through, and. Um, you know, stuff like that. I know I'm yawning and it's daytime. You see the sun out there. Um but I, I don't like I, I understand that people get upset because these guys uh use their muscle and use their physique to sell product and um they think that that's wrong. And listen, I completely agree with you. If someone is on steroids and they're saying I did this all natural, you can do it too. Um, I, you know, I would be upset because if I was a natural person and I say, Hey, listen, I got this body being on natural. Someone said, well, you're not as big as this, and this person. And like, yeah, well, that person's on steroids. Okay. So, you know, I get it, but also look at, um, look at the adverse, you know, um, let's say somebody like, uh, CT Fletcher who grew up in Compton. It's a, that's a rough neighborhood. He could have been a gangster shooting up people and, and all that, those other kind of things. Uh, Callie Muscle grew up in Oakland. You know, he did the bad stuff. He got caught. He got, you know, busted for armed robbery. Uh, he was pimping. He was selling drugs. And, you know, he, he got busted. And he did the wrong stuff. And he changed his life around. If he's on steroids, he's on steroids. If he's not, he's not. But the one thing that is a fact is that... Um, Cali Muscle has turned his life around. He's acting. Um, he's a bodybuilder. He's won a bunch of bodybuilding competitions. He looks great. And he's spreading positivity and motivation. If you can't get down with that, I don't know what to tell you. But, yeah, that, that that's basically it. I'm sitting here having fun with the little animations again. And... and <laughs> It's just fun. So basically, I Watch just this. run the mouse across the different animations. And my ending, you know, you boy G-R-E-J-S-M-O. And I'm a... So. I'm a... 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 <laughs> Listen, I have a really short attention span. This stuff, yeah, gets me through the day. I'm a, I'm a. <laughs> oh, it's too yeah, much you, fun. If you move to bed, should fall right off. Yeah, down. should fall off the bed. I'd rather have her fall off because it's not that high. It's like that big. Yeah, yeah but you don't want to. You don't want to be running and thinking you're gonna fly and then pop on the floor. <laughs> I, I don't know. I just do it all the she time. She might need a full size bed or something. She might need. A stress relief tea. <laughs> what does she have at night? <coughs> Nothing. It's just dinner. <laughs> she did, okay, maybe she needs a little bit of alkaline tea. water. Yeah. She just has physical dreams. She always had a physical dream. I remember. Uh, I remember. She used to get up and scream in the middle of the night. She came over and there. Jazz didn't believe me at first mm -hmm. until it happened. Like, you're like. And I remember until she slapped me. Yeah. 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 No, but she used to she holler was, and scream like somebody's murdering her. But she was, yeah, she was little. She fucked up and boom. She go right back to sleep. I had to wake her up to see me. I was like, hold on, you're not getting away with that. Yeah. But my cousin Sandra was like that. Oh, my God. I don't know. I, I don't, I've been doing uh, good with the YouTube. Like, putting videos out. Yeah. Like, almost every day. And they, and they, call, they answer back? 
Uh, some people do, but not a lot. I got more subscribers now. I used to be, um, for a long time, I only had like a like a couple, like under 50. Then it started climbing. Now it's at 100. Okay. And uh, just the other day, it was at 113. So I've been trying to upload the videos and make sure I... The one where you be in a car and go, Ugh. I said, jazz, a car, what's that noise? Yeah, but that, I mean, that was like three weeks ago, Mom. I, I didn't have, you know... Oh, you made more? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I record. I record videos every day. Okay. And sometimes I get a chance to upload them every day. Sometimes, uh, you know, I make the skip a couple of days. Like Sunday, Sunday and Monday I recorded. Mm -hmm. But I didn't have a chance to upload them until this morning. So Sundays, whatever happened on Sunday, you won't see until today. And then whatever today, happened on yes, Monday, yeah. you won't see on today. I mean, some some people do. Some people, you know, most of the people just watch the video. Some people like it, um, and uh, there's like one or two people that leave a comment or something. But I want to get people to be more interactive, you know. So I yeah, like it's when I watch YouTube, I watch it like a TV show. Like I don't watch it, you know, just looking something up. And like okay. some people will will say, well, you know. How do I uh, hang this uh, poster without it falling? Well, look it up on YouTube. And then you look it up and be a how-to video. Oh, yeah. But then you got YouTube that. videos, you know, like there's how-to videos. There's funny videos where you just record somebody falling down the steps. Or it'll be like a, you know, uh, like a how to put on makeup video. But then there's like the ones that are almost like a TV show where it's like a reality show. You get a chance to see their life and see what's going on. They call that a vlog or a video log. Okay. And that's, that's, you know, where I want my channel to be, like a video log. But I need people, you know, to comment and, um, you know, interact. Mm -hmm. Because I can, you know, just recording a video and putting it up, you know, that's one-sided. You know, you, when it's, uh, you know, when it's the other side, when they comment and they get a little feedback, then you get a chance to, I guess, almost build a relationship with people. Like, there's just one guy down in uh, Atlanta. But is that dangerous? Well, I mean. No, I mean, it, not for you, but, I'm like. But I mean, it's, it's like saying, is it dangerous to meet somebody at a store and say, is hey, my name is, you know, hey, my name is Jazz, what's yours? Okay. You know, hey, you know, what do you have on your plate? Like, when we went to the sushi place, David said that. He said, he said to the one lady, he said, because I said, man, her sushi look big. And David, oh, 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 I'm sorry. I didn't mean to look, but uh, sushi look good. And she was like, yeah, what you got over there? You know, like, <laughs> But, you know, and it, it, it breaks the ice oh and it gets God. people he to... Oh, my God. He said so that so well. Yeah. Yes. He's so, so you know, it breaks the ice and it gets people to, you know, interact with you, you know, to a point where they crave your attention. Everybody wants to feel needed by somebody. So I figured if I put out the YouTube video, then when people reply or leave a comment, you know, I could answer back and, you know, you could build that relationship. And you bring people closer over the Internet Instead of saying, oh, well, I'm in this state, you're in that state, we'll never meet, we'll Two never be friends, I'll never have a chance to learn your personality later. or see that there's somebody else out there that's like me. dark it gets so early it's 5 47 or 5 45 right now and uh, it's already dark so just a real quick uh, little recap I went to um, you know my old uh, uh, you know my old hood where you know I used to coach and uh, had a little wrestling practice with man it was great and um, now I'm on my way to J&J &J. damn look at that look at that dark I'm on my way to J and J to go, um, you know, do a little bit of, uh, you know, my own thing. So I'll see you guys when I get so there. So I just got out the gym, J and J Fitness, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all, it was not fun. I actually hit 405 on whatever kind of bench press he has, and uh, that was the first time. I mean, it was, he helped, he helped, he helped. So, but I still pushed it up three times, but he helped though. And uh, he had me maxing out a little chest press. Yo, heavy. I haven't lifted in the, like heavy in a while. And I've been lifting consistently in a while. So it was tough. But, you know, that's why I go there. You know, if it was easy, I'd go back to planet. And, uh, you know, I would make no gains. 
So I'm gonna go to ShopRite and try to find this black bean pasta, try to whip up a couple of meals for tomorrow, and uh, I'll see what I can do, all right? Check you so, guys later. Acme didn't have it. ShopRite didn't have it. The only place I've ever seen a black bean pasta that I like is on Amazon. And um, the price of it has changed. When I first bought it, I think I had six of them for like 30 bucks, something like that. Now, they're like $10 a piece. <sighs> the macros were so good. So good. I should have loaded up. I didn't. I mean, you could, like the black, it was more, it was like almost double the amount of um, protein per carb. Black beans. So, uh, my wife had made some fried rice with broccoli and tofu. So, so I'm going to sit here and eat. I started munching on this persimmon already. I'm gonna catch up on some YouTube videos. And on my second screen, I'll start editing mine. I'm really disappointed. The Acme, they used to have the Lenny and Larry's uh, complete um, cookie. Didn't have those. My wife has been telling me not to buy anything from Amazon because the Amazon credit card is all run up and you know money's a little a little snug and I've been wanting to get these things I just haven't because I ain't got no money so once we get the bills paid off after the holiday and tax season rolls around <sighs> pay everything off and then we'll, we'll buy it but instead of buying it with the Amazon credit card we'll buy it with our own bank account it just pisses me off man like I really was looking forward to starting you know this new high protein diet with all plant protein you know bodybuilder style low carb high protein vegan diet but we gotta wait until you know cash starts rolling in but whatever. So, enough of me rambling on. We'll go ahead and uh, you know edit these videos. Yeah, I think that's it. So this is your boy G R E J S M O, and I'm at. my way, you know what I mean? Ain't nothing like it. It ain't nothing like paying them bills on time. Enough dough left to know that we still gonna shine, but it's never enough.